welcome back to Giving Chances Farm. Today was the second or third day. This, well, yeah, this would be the third day today that um, the ducks have been in the little A-frame chicken tractor. And so on this, on the third day, we decided to open the door. So I came out here in the morning and opened the door to the chicken tractor to allow the ducks and the chickens to intermingle with each other. <laughs> so, so far, all of them look like they are getting along fairly well. The ducks seem to be staying together. And then each of the chickens, they break down into their own little individual groups. So like Penguin right there, he hangs out with the Australorps. I don't know which one, but some of the hens of them, he hangs out with them. So they're just out here scratching around, getting dust in my eyeballs. Ducks are over there having a heyday, doing their own little thing. So, earlier I just kept all of their, their water and their little, um, I, it's used as a feeder, but that's what I gave them until we decide whether or not we want to give them a, um, a baby pool. So, that's what they use to dip in their, dip in some water and stuff, so. Waddle's got to get his little two cents in, but we're going to have to build like a little ramp right there into the chicken coop for the ducks to um, go in, whether we use bricks for like a step to get up there or we just use a board for them to uh, crawl up in or on them in. As you can see, the chickens don't mind the ducks being in the same pen with them. So hopefully, um, with them being out and mingling with the chickens, and the chickens aren't afraid of us, so hopefully that will, they will learn trust, the ducks that is, learn to trust us when we come around and not be um, skittish like they, they have in the past. I can see some of some of the ducks, they have like a a greener bill on them with us not ever having ducks. It's kind of hard for us to tell whether or not the drakes from the um, the hens. So, if you have any pointers, leave those comments down below to let us know <laughs> what the the difference is between a drake and a a hen in the khaki Campbells. I know they say the up, the curled up tails is usually the drakes. I know the the feet. One of them's a little darker than the other. And when they get, I think, bigger, the around their neck to their head kind of thing gets a little bit darker in the in the males, but. Like I said, this is new to us, so I'm not for sure how to tell what is what, but I can see there is a, maybe one, two, three of them have a, uh, a little lighter green color bill on them. So, let's see. 
And that one right there has the lighter green color bill. And that one that just walked right there has a lighter green. The one over here right there has a lighter green. Mr. Waddles. You always gotta say something, don't ya? Well, Mr. Penguin, on the other hand, he ha he don't really crow too much. But Mr. Waddles does. All the time, he's making noises. I don't have anything. Another one of the Ostrovorps. With their green feathers when the sun hits them. I should say green tinted. And that's another Ostrovorp. <laughs> They're all over here uh, fighting over worms, it looks like. They may learn by the chickens not to be afraid of me. No, I'm not scary. I'm the one that feeds you. Yeah. I'll have to go get them some more grass. Alright. This is going on, I think, on uh, day two or three of the ducks being out. They still, they don't want any part of going in, into the barn yet, so that's why the a thing is still out here. We're just leaving that and then they put themselves up at night time and we just close the door and lock them in there and they're they're fine with that they've stayed out of the the a-frame more still haven't seen anything going on with the, the chickens messing with them or anything they're kind of just like of course waddles has to put his two cents in Looks like I need to give them a little bit more water. The chickens also drink out of that thing on top of the the ducks swimming in it and dipping their bodies. I shouldn't say swim because there's not enough room for them to swim, but they dip their bodies in there. And, uh, they don't seem like they're scared of the, the chickens. They kind of just do their own thing. is that that lighter color I think she may be a it may be a hen hopefully she's pretty still try and figure that out been feeding them some of this grass that's why all these chickens are over here waiting for me to come and throw some grass over for them but the ducks are doing the same thing they uh, are eating some of the grass and they're getting along. And that's all that matters right now is let me see if they'll come over here with the chickens and eat. Yep, they're gonna come over here and mingle in with the Are 
are mooing at me. They think they need to come back up here. And I'm like, no, we got to let the, the grass rest. <laughs> got to give the grass so long to rest before they come back. There we go. And that's how the, the chickens are. Any time I put new grass down, they're over there getting that. They're like little kids. If one of them has it, the other one has to have it. And then they switch spots. But just thank, thank you guys for hanging out with us. Thanks for subscribing to our channel and thanking you for uh, anytime you share our videos to bring on more subscribers that helps our channel a bunch and we couldn't do it without you guys subscribing and watching our our videos if you have any ideas of something different that you think that we may do or could possibly do just leave those down in the comments and ask and we'll see if we can uh, fulfill that question of the uh, idea for a video so thanks again for hanging out with us and have a nice day